Hi guys, it's Sinamka4 here with the Galaxy S3 smartphone. We're going to take a look at how to tether your smartphone to your laptop. And by that I mean use the smartphone's data connection to get internet on the laptop that you have. Now this is relatively simple, so what I'm going to do first of all is switch over from Wi-Fi. So Wi-Fi is off and turn on my mobile data. There you go, that's working. Yep, Wi-Fi is off, mobile data is on, excellent. So all, then all you need to do, connect your smartphone to your laptop using the, the cable and the smartphone came with. So obviously the one end you got a USB 2 connector, the other end you got a micro USB port. Obviously the one end goes into your smartphone, like that, and the other end just plug into a USB port on your laptop. Now just before I plug that in, uh, into the laptop rather, I'm going to show you the screen of the laptop as you can see by the screen of the laptop there I'm using my son's laptop it's got no internet connection and if I load up an internet browser nothing will happen I'm not even connected to Wi-Fi there there you go so I'm unable to connect to the internet on the Google Chrome browser there so I'll just minimize that for a moment and as I mentioned we connected the one end to the smartphone and the other end of the cable will just plug in to the laptop so that's all done there. The phone recognizes the fact that it's connected. So what you need to do is go into menu, settings, and then at the top, go to more settings. And then you've got tethering and portable hotspot. Tap that. And at the top there, it's got USB tethering, USB connected tick to tether. Now, you must do this after you've connected the cable. So tick it and it says tethered I don't know if you can see that but it's saying installing device driver software in the bottom right of the laptop so it's just configuring the connection but as far as the phone is concerned if I just bring that in there it just says USB tethering tethered so that should be now working and then there we go it says on the screen the network is connected and I'll select this as a home and we won't share any of those this is just as a demo so that's finished so I'll click finish and now you can see there it's saying network 3 and then the internet available I'll just zoom in so you can see that a little bit better so there you go you can see that the laptops there connected to network 3 and then the internet and it says it's all connected so if I bring the browser back in there as you can see now if I just hit refresh just to see if it loads the page and it should be just Google's home page that it loads as it does there so that's working if I just try another one being bbc whoops .co .uk. That should load up as well. Now, obviously, this is going to be only as quick as the connection and the signal that you have on your smartphone. So, bear that in mind when you're out and about. If you've got a really shoddy signal, then obviously the speed of the internet isn't going to be that great. Just remember, any internet that you do use through your device, being a laptop or, I should I say, this even works on uh, the PS3 or uh, Xbox 360 as well. So, any data that you use while the device is tethered to your smartphone will come out of your monthly data usage so just remember if the internet stops working that's because you've gone over your your data limit but yeah this works on other devices like the ps3 and the xbox 360 as well just works in a similar manner once you're done just take the tick out of it so it untethers itself and then you're good to go and if i go back again and i hit refresh on this it says unable to connect to the internet because I've just untethered it and same goes for the connection behind it there's a red X there saying it's not connected anymore but that's how easily you can connect your Samsung Galaxy S3 smartphone and tether it to your laptop Xbox 360 or even PlayStation 3 for that matter any questions or comments that you guys have got hit them up in the comment section down below there if you haven't already done so hit subscribe from the button up top there it doesn't cost you anything and it's free and you can check out some of our forthcoming videos if you like what you saw and you want to see more videos like this give us a big thumbs up thanks for watching have a good day and we'll see you next time